My name is Kent Jones. I'm the owner of East Coast Waterfowl. And when did you start East Coast Waterfowl? November 14th, 2013. So Instagram had just been getting started and uh, Facebook was real big at this time. So my wife was on Instagram, well my girlfriend at the time, wife now. Um, she was on it there and she's like, you need to get Instagram, you need to get Instagram, post all your duck hunting pictures. I was like, okay. Got on there, started posting my duck hunting pictures. There was other pages on at, at the time that reposted people's pictures. Well, I would send them my stuff, send them my stuff, and they would never repost it. So I said, well, screw them. I'm going to make my own page. So me and the boys were sitting in the bonfire one night, uh, come up with a name. Everybody liked it. And so we stuck with East Coast Waterfowl, started the page the next day, started posting my pictures and like my boys' pictures. And so it kept growing. And after like uh, the first year, year and a half, man, we had like 10,000 followers. And it kept growing. And people were like, well, if you're going to repost my picture, like I need something to wear that says East Coast Waterfowl. And I'm like, I got you. I got 12 hats made. I got the brown and khaki ECW logo. I got like six visors and like 30 t-shirts, a couple of each size. I just bought the stuff, it, paid it, and I, every single dollar I made out of selling uh, hats out of my truck, I put back into the business and it just kept growing and kept growing and kept growing. The roots is me selling hats out of my old we had a pickup truck that I still have to this day and I have an inventory in my parents bonus room and I took over my parents bonus room and uh, we moved from my parents house to the house I'm in now and that was me and Philip were living here and uh, I started putting shirts and hats and racks in the hallways and the bedroom and the living room and Philip was like yo this is getting kind of outrageous you need to do something so then we moved into the shop in here. It was the old hog slaughtering barn. We got redone and now we've expanded, taking over the whole building. You know, that's where the roots started was just selling out of the truck. And then now we're here. It's honestly been tough. It's been tough. It's always been a side gig. I never really had done it full time until this past year. In the beginning, I was selling my pickup truck. Well, I was in college. I went to BLET, basic law enforcement training in Cape Cotteret, and I lived in my parents' camper for a little while. I forgot that part. Um, and in the camper, we had a little extra room off to the side. Well, I had to store all my duck hunting stuff in there. And, uh, and I, I was shipping out orders out of there, out of the camper, and then going to class at nighttime. So I was like doing, working, all that sort of stuff during the day, trying to promote East Coast Waterfowl, studying for all my classes, and then going to BLET at night. And I did that, BLET was six days a week. Every day was Sunday. And um, so then once I got out of law enforcement, I graduated all that sort of stuff, I uh, went to work in law enforcement. Four of the seven years that I worked in law enforcement, I was working strictly night shift. And then the last three years, I worked two to two, two in the afternoon, two in the morning. It was never easy. Like trying to run a business and working night shift sucks. And uh, then you have shows on top of that. You have, you know, events around here. We're going to make our own outdoor show. You got to take care of the merch shop. You got to have stuff for people to do all day and then honestly like me quitting the police department and doing this full time was probably the best decision I ever made in my life. What makes it worth it to me is like when I go to these shows and see all these folks 
come up to me and come to the booth wearing our stuff and be like, dude, I love your hats. I love your designs. My dog looks just like this uh, dog that you put on your, your hat, whatever you got, uh, whatever we have, you know? And like, that's what drives me to like, the making somebody else happy for me just like selling them a hat, you know? What makes this roots drop so special is we started the original hats from day one being just ECW with the script under it. And then it blew up. People loved it. To this day, they still love it. The second design we come out with was the Woody with the script up under it. And the same thing with the Mallard. We did the Mallard with the script. Still a bestseller to this day. And you know, I haven't put that uh, design on a lot of different hats over the, over the years. And so like now I'm like, this is what makes our business special. It's where we started. Let's put this design on some new hats and get it out to these folks because they always love this design and I think it's going to do great. What also makes it special is like for the t-shirts, we took pictures with a camera and I sent it to my screen printer and he put them on the back of t-shirts. And all the designs for this merch drop come from pictures that I've taken, Chad's taken, and one of them came from a customer. Um, a fan of ours or a customer of ours and probably like the most special one for me is going to be on your mark shirt Remy and my buddy Jared Day um, I hunted with Remy back in like 2012 2013 2014 2015 those those years when he uh, Jared was in college he didn't want her suffering so he had to put her down this year and in honor of that we're going to make the shirt on your mark in remembrance of Remy because she was one of the dogs that drive me to get a duck dog and want to have a, like a killer dog. So I think that that story alone, when Jared talks about it, is going to be epic. With this merch drop, I wanted to keep it clean and simple. And those designs from our roots were clean and simple. And that's why I wanted to bring y'all on new styles of hats and just... It is going to be the biggest merch drop in hats that we've had, and I can't wait for y'all to see it.